Hey everybody, so I have all my stuff, as you can see, I have all my stuff in the back, and I just, huh, my back hurt, it hurts right now, so I'm not moving all this stuff, because I am, I do live upstairs, so, uh, yeah, that's too much for a pregnant woman to move, like, but, I got all my stuff, and, um, it's just I'm emotional and I'm just I'm just going through it right now like but I'm just glad to be somewhere and everything and I'm just glad to have somewhere to live and somewhere to stay and I really thank God he's been helping me along the way I mean I tell you I got a Good. I had a phone call today and it was good news so I am so sad I'm so happy like things are just coming together you know I'm just happy about it so um I'm just gonna have to I'm, move, I'm gonna move some of this stuff but not all this stuff because it is a lot but I'm really just happy that the party is over. <laughs> it's like it's over. Like just enjoy my life and my children, and that's about it. So, yeah. I tell you, it is so hot out there. <laughs> I, I moved some stuff, but not all of it. Um, like I said, but ma'am, whew! I tell you, it is. I'm very tired right now. <laughs> it's, it's been a long day, a long morning, and everything. Um, right now, my baby's going to the wedding and everything. So, glad I have, have her along because we'll be doing that and trying to move stuff in. It's like, be like, really. <laughs> um, but I'm here. I'm just just relaxing right now, taking a little break. Um, it's in the AC. I mean, the fan AC. And eating something and drinking a water. But I still got a lot more stuff in there. I might not move it to like it gets dark, and when it gets dark, like it gets a little cooler outside and stuff. But um, I might, it's I might, or I might just do it tomorrow. But I ran out of this so tired, <sighs> and I have not really eaten anything. I ate like a snack and stuff, but I have not eaten a meal. Like, so I'm very hungry. So I'm definitely gonna go and. Um, get some stuff I need and some food and then come back to the apartment and chill a little bit so hey everybody good morning it's the next day I look a hot mess and I tell you they didn't hook I was about to wash clothes right so they didn't hook the washer and dryer. I never in my life went, I never in my life was in an apartment and then they didn't hook the washer and dryer. So now I gotta put a maintenance request in for them to hook it up. So I'm like, this is crazy. I think I gotta have some clean clothes and stuff because Oh Lord, hammers! I would have to find a laundry man, something to go to. I'm like, man, y'all are not doing like y'all supposed to do. Y'all supposed to check this stuff, right? So I tell you, there's a lot going on <laughs> since I came in this apartment. A lot going on. I mean, I should complain. I mean, at least I'm somewhere, but I just—that was just. So, I would have to go to Walmart again. I've been to the store like 
five times on Renita. Like every time I turn around, I gotta buy something else. I gotta get something else. I'm like, oh my gosh. Like, I already don't have, I already have no money like that. Like, it's for real. I don't, I am, I'm gonna be in a lot of struggle, but. I just trust God and I know God's gonna help me and provide for me, so I know that He is. But yeah, this morning I'm going to go to the store and um, cook. I already put um, some chicken in a slow cooker and everything. And um, for dinner tonight, um, tomorrow I'm planning to go to the church. I haven't been to church for years. Okay. I know I need to go. I definitely need to go to church because it's it's been it's been a crazy time in my life. So I definitely need to go to the church. I've been in this church before. They're pretty good, they're alright. Um of course I'm gonna take y'all with me, but yeah. They definitely need some kind of spiritual healing <laughs> um going on because me i've been through it so yeah so i'm gonna get it ready for the rest of the day so good morning everybody today is sunday 7 48 in the morning yeah i'm going to church i was invited to church um yesterday um i went to a party um, a birthday party. I went to a birthday party yesterday and I had a really good time. I didn't come home till like 11 o'clock at night. And my friend also invited me to church. So I'm getting ready for church right now. Um, the service start at 9.30. So I have plenty of time really. I'm not, I'm not kind of person that wakes up like really early <laughs> like i like to be an hour ahead of time but um yeah i'm going to go to church i really need i definitely really need church right now like all the things that have been happening in my life I, I need something like it's good to be around surrounded by people who love you and care about you and i think god is really showing me that <laughs> by people inviting me places so i'm really happy about that like right now i need to be surrounded by people because it's good and it's better than just sitting at home and you know but this is my outfit <laughs> Let's see. That's how I have. My belly is showing a little bit. I ate a lot last night too. I ate like a lot of food last night. Like I was stuffed. I was like, I was starting to get tired. Like that's how stuffed I was. They had so much food there at the party <laughs> so i like oh my gosh so i definitely like had a really good time i really needed that because i needed to get out of the apartment and you know just hang out with people but right now i'm getting ready for church and everything um, i don't I don't have my tripod. I'm thinking to get a tripod. There's some at Walmart. Because I broke my tripod. I don't know how that tripod broke. But I guess because I used it too much. I kept flipping it. And it broke. I tell you. how Things don't last no more. Everything is so cheap. You know these days. Oh my hair. I can never get my hair right. I did straighten it yesterday, but <laughs> right now it's all over the place. So let's see if I can brush it down. Okay. Yeah, that's a little better. 
one thing I like about short hair is that when you tie it up, it just don't, it, it don't lay down like it should have. So, top of the earth. Bottom of the sides of like I ain't did nothing to it. And it got frizzy, I didn't get in the back. But wait till my hair grows back. Cause I just <laughs> I'm like I need to stop cutting my hair. But every time I go do something, it's like I, I go there and cut my hair, but this time, this is my last time I will cut it. <laughs> and you see, I used to have locks, and now I just I cut it. But I, I'm really happy I did cut it because I just, my, I just didn't like my hair much. I'm not saying I don't like locks, it's just I didn't like my hair much. But yeah. We went to go to church. See what is going on there. Been a, been a rough week for me. It has not been a good week. I have to take one day at a time and just let God handle anything that's coming my way. Just let God handle everything. Cause I can't let I can't just you know just what do you call it, Lord? It's early. <laughs> it's early, like. I don't know what I'm talking about right now. But this let it bother me. I can't let things bother me. Uh, you know, I got a, a, a baby to worry about right now. I got child to take care of. So that's all I need to focus on right now. And not what's going on with, you know, what... But I'm not really worried because I know God has me. I know he has me. That's why he's sending people to invite me places. He sent me someone to invite me to church because I wasn't really thinking about church much. Um, but it feels great to just have people to, who cares about you, you know, worry about you, you know. It is. It is good to have people around you. But, um, <sighs> um, hopefully my week, I pray my week be good and awesome and everything in between because, yeah, I've got a lot going on. But, um, yeah. I'm in the car. Morning sickness is real, y'all. I have a morning sickness. I'm like, man, I forgot. I should have got some ginger ale or something. Uh, because that really helps with my morning sickness. But I'm still going. <laughs> um, I guess the heat too. It's like 82 degrees right now. And it's only nine o'clock in the morning. So it's 82 degrees. But I think it's making it worse. But I'm sitting here with the AC on. <sighs> Look how you being pregnant. <laughs> like, I need more sickness go away. <laughs> I don't like it. But. <sighs> Headed there.
I just got back from the church and it was great. Um, there's a message that I need to hear today. <laughs> Is you know, the thing about God, He always like have messages come through people or just or things, but um. It was really good. And then me and my friend was talking after and, you know, talked about, you know, my life. <laughs> um, but it was great. Like, I felt, I felt great. Um, I think I'm going back up again next Sunday. Um, if I can, take a Libby with me because they have like a children's thing. Um, I, I don't know what they call it, children's ministry or something. So, Olivia would love that because to play with other kids and stuff. But I really liked it. I'm glad I went. Um, it really lifted my spirits up, you know. But me and my friend were talking about some really deep stuff. So, you know. I really didn't want to talk about it on here, but so right now I'm going about to get my daughter, Olivia, and it's been hot. Like it was like 90 degrees and it was only nine o'clock in the morning. I mean, 80 degrees and it was only nine o'clock in the morning. I'm like, oh my gosh. And now it's up to 90 degrees right now. And it's like 11 now. So I'm like, man, it's going to be real hot today. I don't really want to be outside like talking about it. it's too hot. And I think the heat really um, makes me feel a little sicker or whatever. But I'm drinking plenty of water and everything. Um, the church provided drinks and stuff. That was really nice of them. Like some water, coffee, lemonade. <laughs> I had lemonade. It was pretty nice, decent church. It was small. Um, it was a real small church, so it wasn't like one of those big mega churches. It was tiny, you know. I like tiny churches because it's more personal. And uh, pastor was out greeting everybody, so that was really good. Um, and of course, everybody wear regular clothes. Some people was dressed up, but you could wear regular clothes at this church. You don't have to be dressy and all that. But some people was dressy, but it's come as you are church. So I really like churches like that too. Um, so yeah, I came here. I had to turn the air on because it's hot. <laughs> but I was feeling my baby. My baby, I guess my baby loved music because my baby was moving in there while the music was playing. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's all I gotta say. Um, 